Welcome to the theme Thursday on Foot Talk with Sharon. The theme for this month is Dal and today we are moving to the east of India. Today's Dal is a Bengali special Dal called Cholar Dal. It's made using Chana Dal and this is one preparation that people have during breakfast, lunch as well as dinner. The usual combination for this is luchis or puris made out of maida. This dal preparation has a little bit of sweetness added to it as well. So it is a perfect balance of different flavors. So let's quickly check out the recipe. But before we do that, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. And please do click the tiny bell icon too and turn on all notifications. The first step for this dal is to pressure cook the chana dal. So I've soaked the dal for about two to three hours and then we'll be pressure cooking this. This needs to be cooked for three pressures. And in case you've not had enough time to soak the dal, then you can make it four pressures and then leave it on sim for about five minutes and let the pressure release naturally. So once the dal has pressure cooked, you can start preparing the tadka. The preparation of tadka doesn't take a long time. So while the pressure is releasing, at that point, you can start preparing the tadka for this. For the seasoning, let's first fry some coconut slices in ghee. Into the same ghee, let's add some cumin seeds, fennel seeds, whole spices, so bay leaf, cinnamon sticks, cardamom and cloves. Some dry red chilies and some finely chopped ginger. And into this, let's add some chili powder. And then add this tadka into the cooked dal. For this preparation, the chana dal has to be cooked, but it shouldn't disintegrate. It shouldn't be very soft. It still has to retain its shape. We also add a little bit of sugar. Now the quantity of sugar you add is a personal preference. We now need to boil this till it's slightly thickened. Now let's add the fried coconut pieces. You can always you reserve a little bit for garnishing at the end. The zal will thicken as it sits. So if you take it out at this consistency also, it will thicken a little. The cholar dal is ready. You can serve it with some hot luchis.